Well, think about your travels through the years and what makes them pleasant and memorable. And chances are it's got something to do with your experience of the art or of the architecture of that mode of transportation that you've been using. Those are the types of things that I think we can bring to the vine that also make people feel good. There is art for art's sake, which we all appreciate. Uh, and then there is the depiction of history through the written word and photographs. And then there is combining the two. This is functional art. This is art that has a purpose that helps things uh, for our riders, make them more comfortable, make it a more reliable trip. The windscreens are going to be great. They're colorful. They're going to be you get a sense of movement with them and they're tied to the neighborhoods along the corridor. A, a request for uh, proposals went out from C-Tran and uh, to all artists, call to artists, and the artists proposed projects, sent samples, we looked at them. Uh, those that met the criteria, we uh, interviewed. Corin Rolstad Roberto Delgado and Robert Tully were the three that we finally worked with. I designed um, a visual program for the embedded glass and changed it to seasons and changed it to iconic images about seasons that included people. And then the second project I got was, was to give a language to the history of Vancouver in itself. Vancouver is the most historic city in the Pacific Northwest. It was described at one time as one place across time because so much happened here that was noteworthy. I'm hoping that it will uh, uplift our passengers and uh, the citizens of the neighborhoods along the way, as well as providing opportunities for transporting them. You're going to have thousands of people come by and they're going to look at these things and build their own stories. That's what's important to me. Public art is not going into your studio and saying, I am going to do this piece of art. This is my name on it. Public art is a partnership between all the entities involved to build an urban voice.